Hey, this is Victor Antonio with another sales motivation tip just for you. So what makes a good salesperson uh, versus a bad salesperson? What's the difference? Now, here's the difference in the most simplest way you're going to probably hear it explained. Now, if you're the average salesperson, here's what you're doing. You're selling the feature, the functionality, the benefit, and the advantage. Right? Feature, function, benefit, advantage. That's how you've been taught to sell. So you do that. And when you sell the features and the, you know, the functionality, the benefit, advantage, these are qualitative measures. By qualitative means, they're not real numbers. They're not tied down to numbers. And you often hear qualitative phrases being used. For example, you know, our product's real fast, Victor. See, that's a qualitative term. How fast, Victor? I don't know. Just fast, man. It's really fast. And then they say, oh, man, it's good, man. It's really good. Our product is really good. The customer asks you, well, how good is it? He said, man, it's real good. Then they ask you, well, how big is it? Because if it's a big product, man, well, how big is it? Man, it's huge, man. You don't want to know how big it is. It's just big enough to cover your needs, Mr. Customer. Then you say something like, our product's real reliable. Customer says, well, how reliable is it? Man, it's so reliable, you can just rely on it. That's all you have to do, just rely on it. And then you say, man, our product is much better than our competitors. Customer asks, how much better is it? Man, it's much, much better. See, these are qualitative terms, and I'm exaggerating, for example, but sometimes when I hear salespeople talk, that's what it sounds like. They're never really tying it down to what I call the quantification part of it. Now, right here, there's a small line dividing the average versus the best salesperson. On this side, we have value. But when I say value, I don't mean word value. I mean dollar value, quantitative value, quantify the value. Because here's the essence of selling today. When you say something is fast, can you tie it to money? In other words, how can it increase revenue or reduce the customer's cost? When you say it's good, well, how, much, how good is it? Tie that to revenue. If it's big, if it's more reliable, it's better. You get the idea. If you can't tie these words, these qualitative terms, to quantitative numbers, they don't mean anything to the customer. This is just talk. What you want to get to here, uh, here is you want to get to the money side. How do you convert? your features, your functions, your benefits, your advantage to dollar values. How do you increase a customer's revenue or reduce their cost? That's the difference. Average, great salesperson. Pick a side. I hope you'll pick the right side. This is Victor Antonio with another sales motivation tip reminding you, selling ain't hard when you know how. Take care.